welcome back to another video thank you so much for being here if you're new here i hope you subscribe to my channel i'm new to the youtube space if you're interested in seeing the normal content that i share all about me and my family check us out on tiktok or instagram coming at you from tampa florida it is a beautiful day today it's like sunny i think the high is 85 so we just got everybody ready we're about to go to breakfast and then i think we're gonna run to target we actually came into town because my friend has a baby shower so i have that baby shower this afternoon and then i think we're gonna take the kids to bush gardens which will be really fun and we're gonna take you guys along with us we actually got here last night and we met up with a couple of friends and their families for dinner at armature works which is like one of our favorite spots that's actually where we're about to go back to go eat brunch i didn't record a whole lot i'll see what i can put together and include in this video from last night but we were just like super tired from driving it was dark it was super crowded it's gasparilla weekend and then i think like the royal rumble is happening in the st pete area so it's just really crowded over here um, I didn't have the camera out a whole bunch, but I promise I will document today. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Let me know in the comments if there's anything in particular you want to see in our upcoming videos. I know I shared some work from home content and we've just been doing like our day-to-day -day vlog, but if there's anything in particular that you guys want to see, people in the past have asked for like a Q&A with me and Matt, so we would love to film that. I hope you guys enjoy this video of our Tampa trip. I'll see you soon. Are y'all ready? Yep. brunch at armature works and let the kids play outside some we ended up going to a few stores that we don't have in our hometown that tampa has so that's always fun um we went to target and got a few things for the kids there did a quick outfit change i'm on my way to the baby shower and i wanted to show you guys the little basket i have for mama look how cute nipple cream in here which is like needed if you're a breastfeeding mama some towels and washcloth some baby body wash this little cutie outfit i don't want to pull it out and like mess up the whole basket but i also got another cutie outfit in here they're both like a knit material i thought this was like the cutest little basket too you can always use a basket for something right there's some passies i got some ma'am and some ryan and rose just because you never know what baby's gonna like at first and some soft little socks you guys i'm actually running late because we are not used to tampa traffic and it got the best of us so so my friend who's having the baby shower the last time that we were here was actually for her wedding so i haven't seen like our whole group of girls since her wedding so i'm so excited to see everybody see you later It's 8.43, it feels like it's like 11. We ended up going to Bush Gardens and then we tried to go get dinner but everywhere was super crowded so we got takeout and we ate it at the hotel. And now the kids are just relaxing, watching a movie. Brentley's over that away, you can't see her. But we're just watching a movie and I think one thing we learned today is that we don't miss living in a big city. <laughs> so we'll go more into that later but we are all really ready for bed we're kind of ready to be home now right mm -hmm. are you ready to be home baby we are probably not going to eat dessert today <laughs> i think we're gonna get up and eat breakfast here at the hotel and then head home good night
No. Okay. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Is that yummy, Bubby? It is the next day. It's Monday morning. Um, we didn't film any more after breakfast yesterday, so I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a recap, and I'm gonna be sharing something very exciting at the very end of the video. We ended up having breakfast at the hotel yesterday, which the kids thought was so fun. It's so good to see so many friends and like all of these friends that I knew in my early 20s. Everybody's like gotten married and having babies, and it's just like really sweet to see everybody like growing and thriving and their families growing. So I just feel super fulfilled after that trip. I did bring it up a little bit on Saturday night, but Tampa is somewhere that we have always said we're gonna move back to. Like we love Tampa, we loved living there and we wanna get back there. But to be honest, like it was really tough for us to be in the city. Like we just were so overwhelmed with the amount of people everywhere. We just felt like we were in the way everywhere like with strollers and multiple kids and like I honestly think that we've just gotten so used to like the slow paced life of the Florida Panhandle that we're like, we were so ready to come home. It was just a lot of movement and hustle and bustle and the traffic was crazy and it took us forever to get everywhere. So while we had so much fun and we loved seeing everybody and we ate such yummy food, we are very thankful for where we're at and like just feel really at peace with like this being our home for right now. Um, still unsure if it'll be our forever home. Just a little update on our thought process there. On our way home, we did stop at my friend's house who has a small business and she makes the cutest little baby items. She hand embroiders them and I'm going to be sharing the baby's name for the first time with you guys right now. It's called Golden Parker and she just opened it in 2023 and she is doing so good and I'm so freaking proud of her for just taking the leap and like doing what she's always wanted to do. Anyway, she made some baby items for us and we have not shared the baby's name on social media yet. We're naming baby boy Cooper. His middle name will be Jacob. Little backstory on Cooper Jacob. Cooper is what Matt wanted to name the baby from day one and I was like, no, I really liked Jacob. If you guys don't know our story, I see a high risk doctor just because of some history that I have. Because of that, I get really, really high def ultrasound. So like I saw his face and he looks so much like Grayson. He looks so much like Grayson, oh my goodness. But um, after seeing that ultrasound picture, I was like, oh my gosh, his name's Cooper. Like that's Cooper. I just instantly like associated his face and the name Cooper. I told Matt and he was like laughing so hard because he was like, am I really going to win this one? And I was like, yes, <laughs> I don't know why, but all of a sudden I just know that his little name is Cooper. So we went with Cooper Jacob, which is also CJ. Um, so I don't know how much we'll stick with the nickname, but I do like that it's an option. Little onesie that she made me, and this little crew neck, and I think that she has the onesie and the crew neck available on her website. So I'm gonna be sharing his name in my Instagram stories after this video goes live. So if you're interested in my friend's little small business shop and wanna order something as a gift, I will tag her in my stories and then add it to highlights so that y'all can go find her on Instagram and place an order. I have so many friends who are pregnant right now, so I'm actually ordering like four different things. I think that this one's coming to the hospital with us. But now that baby name is out there, I did order a sign for his room and I'll be sharing more of his like room decorations and everything coming up. The rest of our trip went really well. We got home around 3.30 and we ended up unpacking and like doing all the laundry, ordered groceries and we got pizza for dinner, but the house is stocked and the laundry is done. I was so happy that we were so productive just cause it like makes for a better week. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed our little travel vlog and I really hope if you're new here, you subscribe to our channel and let me know if there's anything in particular you wanna see coming up. I know after this video, I do have a full day as a work from home parent. I'm gonna be sharing all of that with you um, here coming up in the next week or so, but I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you later.